hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Jacinta so today I just want to encourage you guys I just want to ask you what are you afraid of what are you afraid of Zig Ziglar said that fear is false evidence appearing real And God said, I have not given you a spirit of fear, but I've given you a spirit of power, love, and a sound mind. What are you afraid of? Are you afraid of failing? Shoot for the moon. Because even if you miss, you may land among the stars. Les Brown. What are you afraid of? Are you afraid of your accent? Are you afraid of the way you sound? Are you afraid of the way that you pronounce your words? What are you afraid of? I was encouraged when I found out that Winston Churchill, a former Prime Minister in UK, speech impediment but he gave many great orations what are you afraid of are you afraid that people are going to talk about you are you afraid that people are going to say things about you their opinion of you don't matter they don't pay your bills they're not giving you breath. So their opinion is irrelevant. So I want you to stop being afraid and shoot for the moon. Because even though if you miss, you are going to land among the stars. You have power in you more than you know. You have greatness in you more than you know. The Bible says, Now unto him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above and beyond all that you can think or imagine, but it's according to the power that is at work within you. <laughs> have power in me, the Bible says. I am able to do exceedingly. I am able to do anything that I want because I have greatness in me. I have power in me. He that is in me is greater than he that is in the world. <laughs> you are great. You are powerful. Don't worry about what people are going to say. Because regardless, whether you do nothing or you do something, they're still going to talk about you. The only opinion that should matter about you is the opinion of God and the opinion of yourself. It doesn't matter what your parents have said about you. It doesn't matter what your friends have said about you. It doesn't matter what your pastor have said about you. It doesn't matter what your great grandparents have said about you. All that matters is what God has said. He has given you a spirit of power. He has not given you a spirit of fear. He has given you a spirit of power and a sound mind. You are able to do exceedingly, abundantly above and beyond because you have power in you. Don't allow your skin tone or the way you look or anything stop you from trying. Go after your dreams. Go after your goals. Work hard. You can become anything you want.
Go ahead. Try it. Shoot for the moon. You'll see. You might even hit the moon. But if you don't, you might hit the stars. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful and blessed day. Bye-bye.